In this video, I'm gonna compare four MagSafe battery packs for iPhone. The results may not be what you'd expect. Keep watching to the end of the video to find out which one I think is the best buy. I'll even show you a neat trick you can do with all of them when viewing video. I'm reviewing the following MagSafe chargers for iPhone. CoSeed, Anchor PowerCore 5K, Anchor 6220, Apple MagSafe battery pack. They range from cheap to expensive. These are all roughly the same size, but lining them up, you can see the differences with the Anchor PowerCore 5K being the smallest. All fit neatly onto the back of my iPhone 13 mini. With the Anchor 622 and the CoSeed overhanging. The Apple MagSafe pack has the flushest fit with the Mini. All of them charge a MagSafe equipped iPhone without issue. The Apple and the Anchor 622 will automatically charge the iPhone as soon as they are attached. The Anchor Power Core and the CoSeed need to be attached and then switched on before they'll charge the iPhone. I don't think this is a major issue, but it may be a problem for some people. I've noticed all having some degree of warmth, but the Apple one seems to produce the least heat after a prolonged charge. Here you can see a thermal video of the CoSeed after charging for a long period of time. Both the Anchor chargers charge by USB-C, while the Apple will only charge using a lightning cable. The CoSeed can be charged by lightning or USB-C, However, I did experience issues charging over USB-C, but I didn't experience the same issues charging over lightning cable. All apart from the Apple one can charge other devices. The Apple pack has the strongest magnetic stick. The anchor along with the co-seed are the weakest. Apart from the Apple pack, they all have LED indicators to show the amount of charge left in the pack. To find out how much is left in the Apple one, you have to attach it to your phone. However, the Apple pack is the only pack to show you the charge level through iOS. The Anchor 622 can function as a phone stand too, which is a useful feature. I have all four, but which one do I think is best? Certainly the Apple one offers the slickest experience, but I don't personally think this is worth the extra money. I think the Anchor PowerCore 5K offers the best value for money. It has a great finish, a reasonably good stick, can power other devices with the USB-C cable and cost me 30 pounds. Essentially, all of these devices will charge your iPhone via MagSafe and the differences are very subtle and depend on what you think is important. And now for that tip on what to do while watching video. So attach your MagSafe battery and just easily turn your iPhone so it's horizontal. Now all you have to do is hold the MagSafe battery. That's much easier. Thank you, goodbye.